This video is sponsored by Rockland Flooring. Visit our website for more information. After attending the TMC conference in fall 2022, conveniently located in our backyard of Cleveland, Ohio, I decided to stop over at a coffee shop nestled within the conference center before heading back home. As I waited for my order, my eyes were drawn to a vibrant bulletin board perched in the corner, dressed with an array of multicolored sticky notes. Amidst the sea of uplifting affirmations like believe in yourself and embrace the journey, there was one note that effortlessly seized my attention. Without trucks, America stops. The vague, broad, and somewhat obvious statement admittedly stopped me in my tracks as I reflected on every single thing I owned. It was most likely at one point or another being delivered via trucks. I mean, think about it. Every shelf of every store, the meals you order from a restaurant, the countless Amazon deliveries conveniently showing up at millions of doorsteps on the daily are all transported by trucks at our request. That said, keeping that precious cargo we so much rely on safe and secure through its journey from the production facility to the shelf is just as important as having a truck's engine in working condition. You know, we might not think about trailer flooring being on the top of the maintenance checklist, but your trailer has got to be ready to support the delivery without falling through in both a literal and figurative sense. This puts a lot of pressure on your trailer floors, and can they support the load? According to sources at Rockland Flooring, a higher quality flooring option leads to longer service life and a better resale value potential, as it remains in good condition for a longer period of time. For example, the company's Defender 24 flooring option is designed to protect against water and road debris that can damage the wood and glue line. A stronger flooring option in your trailers eliminates the routine maintenance of the underside of your floors, thanks to improved protection against rot and decay, and careful sealing to keep out the elements and moisture, wood's biggest enemy. Additionally, a stronger flooring means more support for a heavier load. What trailer maintenance practices can fleets implement into operations to protect the value of their resale and trailer longevity as it relates to the flooring and overall construction? As I previously mentioned, moisture of any kind can be your trailer flooring's worst nightmare. Keeping it dry and avoiding prolonged exposure minimizes the potential of decay and rot. Moisture from rain or snow that gets into the back of the trailer door or at the entry point should be quickly addressed to avoid it. According to the pros at Rockland Flooring, it's additionally important to ensure that the designated team of forklift operators take extra precaution while loading and unloading the trailers, as forklift divots, gouges, and scratches can quickly damage the trailer flooring or speed up wear and tear. Regular maintenance inspections conducted prior to and following a delivery can ensure that any debris or moisture is dealt with in a timely manner. Regular cleaning allows for a closer inspection to identify early signs of damage like cracks, tears, or soft spots. With that said, it's obvious as to why protecting your bottom of your trailers concurrently protects your fleet's bottom line. For more trucking and equipment content, hitch a ride to the Fleet Equipment site at fleetequipmentmag.com. Thanks for watching.